What's been on your mind this last week? I'm just starting to feel moved in at my apartment. Oh, congratulations. What makes you feel moved in? Figuring out the showers. I live in, a, in an 1860 townhouse. Okay. And it's got a lot of idiosyncrasies of which, none of which am I familiar. What's your most hard to figure out idiosyncrasy? I haven't figured it out yet. <gasps> What's the one you keep hitting your head up against? How to turn off that just grinding engine in my head that just keeps going and going and going until I finally fall off to sleep. I feel like we're the same person because that's exactly what I was going to say when I was thinking about try asking myself that question. I have no off switch. I don't either. What do we do about that? Drink a lot of wine. Do you have any? Not with me, but I'm headed towards that soon. Must be good to be home again, sir. Well, we'll see about that. We probably should be talking about Blacklist. Part Robin Hood, part Silence of the Lambs, uh, part sexy, intriguy, great-looking FBI agents, which is never hard to, to wrap your head around. But I love watching you. You got rid of your highlights. <laughs> you look much less Baltimore. I love watching your face during the show. So nuanced. I have no interest in cases that I have no interest in. Personally, I think my proposal was incredibly fair. I mean, that's a trick. No. You don't understand part of that, in that they shot him very, very tight. Okay, but it's not a trick. You're still um, making the No, the there's faces. things going on, but there's definitely things going on. I was very lucky. Somebody once said to me when I was very, very young and just starting out as an actor, a camera doesn't just see your face. It looks through your eyes and into your head. And that's true, I think. The camera cannot, though, decipher what you're thinking. Okay. It can only see that you're thinking. Right. And an audience projects an awful lot. Uh, so part of the trick of working as an actor is to be comfortable enough to allow yourself to just live and think and breathe in front of a camera, and the camera takes care of a lot of the rest of it. <laughs> of course not. <laughs> Do you have an idea of what you want the audience to be thinking while they're watching your face? No. If you don't make any attempt to show the audience anything, then the audience wants to look further and further and further. Which is the goal. And I think that's what that character does. He doesn't show a great deal but he draws you to look further in. Why involve me? I'm nobody. It's my first day. Nothing special about me. Oh, I think you're very special. Watch the show. It's a great show. I don't know which is my camera, but... Yes. Watch, watch, watch Blacklist. It's awesome. Have you seen it? Yes! That's how I know about the like face. It? I liked it very much. Did you not hear what I said that I like watching I did, you in the I did, but I'd show? forgotten. I became much more intrigued with the other things you, you were talking about. You are not listening about. to me. You don't no, listen. I would listen to everything. You're a charmer. I'll see you in Brooklyn. You'll see me in Brooklyn. <laughs>